Hello and welcome to another installment of Evacco Lab video. In this video, we will take a look at critical micelle measurement by measuring surface tension using the Wilhelmy plate method. Here in our nano analytical lab, we use a Kiowa DY700 surface tensiometer and a Hiranuma UCB2000 auto puree. If you've watched our surface tension video, you are familiar with our concept of Wilhelmy plate and surface tension measurements. Let's take a look. What do things like anti-fogging liquids, emulsifiers, fabric softeners, and adhesives have in common? The answer, they all use surfactants. Like soap, they interact with one substance to change its properties so that it increases the contact between the first substance and another substance. Shaving cream is another example of a surfactant. When you pull a razor along the skin to remove hair, the cream helps lubricate the interface of the skin and the blade. Adhesives are used on stamps to stick the stamp onto the envelope. Fabric softeners coat the fabric with a thin layer of chemicals, making the fabric softer, more resistant to wrinkling and piling, and easier to iron. Let's look at the surfactant. A surfactant molecule has the characteristics of both hydrophobic and hydrophilic groups. Solutions with lower concentrations of surfactant may have a higher surface tension than solutions with a higher concentration of surfactant. However, at some point, the surface tension will not change even if the solution becomes more concentrated. When adding concentrated surfactant to water, the surface tension may have very little change due to the very low concentration of surfactants. Surfactant molecules are absorbed to the surface of the water with hydrophobic tails in the air and the hydrophilic heads in the water. Then, as the surface will accumulate surfactant, the surface tension will decrease. When there is no more space on the surface, a micelle will form with the hydrophobic tails inside and the hydrophilic heads outside. As the concentration becomes even higher, micelles begin to form in the bulk of the area, but the surface tension stays the same. This is referred to as critical micelle concentration. For the test, three different types of dish soap were compared. Dawn, palm olive, and full circle. Let's take a look at our results. In the CMC results, palm olive is about 7.5 times more than dawn, and full circle was about 7 times more than dawn. This indicates that you can use less detergent when using dawn than using full circle or palm olive. From the surface tension values, you can see that Dawn had the highest surface tension reduction. With Dawn at 25.5, it indicates a higher affinity between water and the other substance. That's all for this installment of Vibatco Lab TV. We hope you enjoyed and will visit us again. Keep an eye out for more videos covering diverse topics from our lab. If you have any questions about either the methods or the instrument you saw here today, please don't hesitate to give us a call or shoot us an email. Our contact info can be found on our website, and as always, if you're interested in nanomechanical and surface characterization lab services or consultation, please give us a call. We'd love to hear from you.